said we can trust him. All right, guys. Yes, as you guessed it, celebration video. Brandon's video house tour got to a hundred views. I am so proud of my brother. He is do he is doing better on my channel than I am. <laughs> but today, um, we're not really gonna. We actually could film the cats. So our parents are downstairs, and my mom doesn't really want to be on video. So. And I don't think my dad would either. <laughs> so we're upstairs today in what was the toy room, now it's the computer room. It's still a toy room, but uh, it's more like a computer room than a toy room. Because they got their computer and printer here that does not work. Um, they work on that though. <laughs> well, the computer does work, but we don't have internet. They kind of, they have Wi-Fi, it's just... I think I hooked it up wrong. Um, but yeah, so today is basically just like um, a what we're going to be doing in February and kind of um, what the what we're going to be doing with the litters. Hopefully that will be coming hopefully in April. And last week I saw a blue-eyed cat, but I haven't seen him since the last time I saw him. If you're thinking he might have been a kitten, that is not true. Um, some cats, I actually looked it up, like I told you I was going to. Oh. Yeah, um, I looked it up, and there actually are a few um, breeds of cats that have blue eyes their whole lives. Well, lots of cats have different eye color. Um, the Himalayan. They have blue eyes, and the Siamese cats. Oh. Even some versions of hairless cats have blue eyes. Now, if you are allergic to cats, a hairless cat might be the way to go, personally. I don't know about you, but I don't like hairless cats. Well, I don't really like them either. I think they, they are just like the ugliest things on the planet. <laughs> well, there's nothing disgusting about it either. So, I, I just don't like them. Well, this cat is not the Siamese. It, it has white on it, his, its paws are gray, and his face is gray, and his eyes are Did he have, like, blue. longer fur? Well, no, kind of short, but not short, short. Well, it might have been a Himalaya. We don't know. I would have had to see the cat, but as Ryan said, the cat is not around anymore. Could have just been a male stray looking around for a mate. Yeah, but I gave him a name. Oh, you didn't tell me that. What's your name? Well, it's a boy's and a girl's name. It's an odd name for a girl, but I'll tell you anyways. His name, its name is Daryl. Oh, nice. For now. For now. Unless he decides he wants to stay with us, then we'll give him a pro proper name. He definitely sniffed like, what the last time I saw him? And he let me pet him for the first time. Wonderful. And I definitely introduced him to our other cats. <laughs> I told him that if he causes trouble, he's gone. But, but I suppose he decided to leave just so that he doesn't cause trouble. And besides, our cat Marshall, who's injured, he kind of hissed and growled at him. Marshall is just asserting his dominance in the territory. Yeah, but I think it's also because he's sick, because he... And Marshall is, is the oldest male. Yes. Alright. Can I tell them what's going to happen in February? Sure. Okay, in February, I do not have my paper in front of me, so I might forget one or two things, but you can always watch our past videos. Um, so here we're going to be in February. In February, near the end of February, because there's snow everywhere outside in Pennsylvania, if you're from Pennsylvania, if you're watching this in another state where you don't get snow, there you go. Now you've seen it. Um, so if you're in a southern state where you don't get snow, come to Pennsylvania, you'll see a lot of it. <laughs> Um, in February, one of the main things that we're going to be doing near the end of February, probably the last week of February, I'll pick the, war the day that's supposed to be the warmest. And after lunch, me and Brandon will take you outside 
here and we're going to give you a proper barn tour and we'll show you where we found kittens in the past years mm, yeah in the barn yeah and if any of you are interested i'll tell you what i do in the summer can we do that in a different video i uh, guess we can okay. we'll tell you all about that next week on monday or wednesday whichever day um we do a video with brandon um, so we're going to be doing a barn tour at the end of February. Brandon is going to be learning a little more of how to deal with skittish kittens. Fun? Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> and uh, we're going to be talking more about how we name kittens in the past, how we plan on um, naming kittens this year. I will tell you a little bit, um, when we were younger, we used to name kittens after characters in Disney movies. We still do sometimes do that. We had a whole litter that was all characters from The Lion King. Do you remember that? Barely, because it was a long we time ago. We had a Timon, we had a, we had a Timon, we had a Pumba, we had a Nala, we had a Simba. I think we even had a Mufasa. I, I, I think we even had a Zarabi. I guess we did. Yeah, so we've, I think we even had a cat named Rafiki. Well, we probably did. <laughs> but, we so, know, but we didn't have a cat named Scar or Ed, no, Chancey, and Bonzo. No, but we did have, we had a, we had a cat named after a monkey, Rafiki. <laughs> Actually, he was a boo boo, not a monkey. I don't know, whatever. Um, so that's going to be a lot of fun. Um, this year, I don't know how well you guys are versed in your movies. Of is the the movie we talked about? Is that a Disney movie? Uh, it depends on what movie it was called. Well, we're thinking of actually doing um, the first litter of this year. I'd like to do um, an Anastasia theme. And that's not a Disney movie. That's the twenty third. And Don Bluff and Gary Gordon. Actually, I think Disney bought them out. Ah. Uh, Disney okay. bought Fox and 21st Century it's Fox. It's from so Don Bluff and Gary Goldman were the producers of that movie. Don Bluff was a producer of other movies like uh, American Tale 1 and 2. Didn't what else did, could have happened? Didn't they do 3 too? Yeah, I guess they did do 3. What else could have happened? The Secret of Nim. And uh, The Land Before Time. And another one that I don't remember. Carrie here doesn't like the first and the third Land Before Time. I like the ones that have good music. You see, the reason why she doesn't like the first one because she's so afraid of Sharp Tooth. And also, it doesn't have songs, but it has songs at the end. Did yeah. I tell you how it's embarrassing during these videos? Oh, I'm sorry, Carrie. Sorry, never mind what I said about her not liking Wish this. I could video edit these videos. I could take that part out. <laughs> Anyways, so um, Disney actually, I think actually they did Anastasia before they were bought out by Disney, but 21st Century Fox was bought out by Disney because Fox was bought out by Disney and everything Fox went with it. And also, if you did, if you wanted to know, Pixar was also bought out by Disney and they're trying to make a deal with DreamWorks Pictures, which is the producers of Shrek. Yeah, there's also other movies that are from there. Yeah, I don't remember what. Madagascar. Oh yeah, that was a good movie. And we also, should, we should, we should so was. Find that again. <laughs> when the virus is over, we should go to the library. Yeah. So, anyways, um, we're not really sure if we're gonna do any other movies this year. You know, we could do a Scooby Doo version of it. We could do a Scooby Doo litter. Yeah. We might do Scooby Doo litter. I actually had a friend, his brother named their cat Scooby Doo. Really? We could have a cat, we, we could have a, a cat named Scrappy Doo. <laughs> That'd be interesting. <laughs> so we're probably going to do a Scooby Doo litter this year. We're going to we're gonna try to have a lot of fun with our naming this year. Um, Brandon probably won't want to go with the Apollo route. I know, because the last time <laughs> we had a Apollo, that turned out to be a girl. So we named her Moo Moo because she was black and white. Well, actually my boyfriend. Well, actually my husband did. He was my boyfriend at the time. So, anything else you want to say, Brandon? Or are we pretty much done with our celebration video? 
just want to let you know that the more we talk about this virus that's going on, the more it will stay here. The more that you say that it's gone, the less it will be here. And it will shrink. Do you want to do the cool ending? Like what? Yeah, thanks. Alright. So make sure you click that thumbs up button and subscribe and don't forget to comment. Oh, and it's February. Yes. It's February. That means Valentine's Day. That means contest Day. time also. So in the comments of the videos in February, please write down something that you love. And whoever has the cutest answers, click by me and Brandon. We'll get a really special prize made by me. So, click the thumbs up button, subscribe, and comment. And we'll see you next time on... The Brandy Moyer Show. <laughs> and the Carrie Thunk. Bye, Cat Family.